<clears throat> Ellie would arise on the shores of Valor with a new companion in his numbers, an, en an enigmatic young girl named Ninian. The majority of the island is covered in dense forests. Legend has it that no one has ever returned from those dark woods. A dense fog crawls over the party, engulfing them one by one. Cautiously, they move deeper into the trees. <clears throat> Chapter 18 The Dread Isle <clears throat> So, hello everybody, what is going on dudes? It is Kibushimaki here, and we see at the Dragon's Gate there's some things happening. Last time, um... Well, we kind of began to make our way to the Dread Isle after taking on Captain Fargus' challenge and, uh, well, protecting his ship, of course. Now we see just what's going on here on the Dread Isle. Shame on you, Master F Marquez Fare. You freed the boy and the girl? I would not let you move unopposed. What? What? What shall we do, Lord Nergal? With both siblings gone, we can no longer hold the ceremony. How many times must I tell you, Lord Darren? You are being used by this man. By helping him bring dragons back into this world, you're helping him destroy mankind. Do you understand? <laughs> destroy mankind? Dragons may have been a threat to mankind in ages past, but with Lord Nergal's power, we've got nothing to fear. Lord Nergal can, can control dragons. <laughs> Lord Darren, you're already lost. I plan to start a war in Lysia. The war I was plotting in Lysia would have generated a glorious amount of force in one blow. You were not equal to the task, it seems. Not to worry, I have other means at hand. Black hearted fiend. Ugh. Hold your tongue. This is still a task you must perform for me. Ephidel, Limstella. <laughs> Thank you. My beloved morphs, my beauteous works of art. I have new jobs for you, my pets. First, Limstella. You will go to Burn and contact Sonia. I want you to arrange a meeting with the king. Understood. Ephidel, take this man, Marquez Laus, and go. I want you to exterminate the mice who have landed on this island. Yes, master. That leaves you, Marquez Ferre. Seems your legacy is one of endurance. The mouse who interfered with my conquest of Lycia is named Elliwood. Should he be congratulated on making it this far? Elliwood, my son is here? Stop! Do with me what you will. Let my son be. Hmm? <laughs> <laughs> Remember the siblings you freed? The girl's here too. As a matter of fact, she's with your son, Elliot. Quite a delicious twist of fate, wouldn't you say? This can't be. Elliwood will die in these woods. The girl will be returned to me, and a ceremony will take place. Despite those long hours of torture, you remain undaunted. Such courage will make you the perfect sacrifice, Marquez Ferre. Hollywood, turn back. Take the girl and flee. Please. I can't believe it's come to this. I must inform Lord Hector of these events. Ferre, I may be in time. What? Layla, where are you going? Lord Hefidel, the sentries. I'm going to check on... You overheard, did you not? And I had such hopes for you. Jafar! Ah! Uh, the punishment for traitors is death. It seems Layla suffered a cruel fate. Ah. <laughs> uh, Ma Matthew. Impressive, Jafar. Your power is beyond compare. Take this woman's corse, corpse and leave it in the forest. Let it serve as a warning to those fools. 
Valor Isle. Let's get through these woods. It's starting to get foggy. Try not to get separated. Enter and be lost. It feels like we're not coming back. Hector, are you trying to curse us? Are you well, Ninian? Y yes, I'm... I'll be fine. Someone's there. Who? A sentry? Layla, is that you? Press of work finding your way here. Something's wrong. Layla. Lay! She's dead. No. This can't be. She was one of our best spies. Layla. I'm sorry, Matthew. Why do you apologize, my lord? Layla blundered. That's all. Matthew. Layla was... She was... After this mission, I was gonna ask her to put this life behind her. I waited too long, didn't I? <laughs> my lord, might I rejoin you later? She has to be buried. O of course! Ah, I'll go with you. Let them be alone. There's nothing else we can do. Blast! They put her out here for us to find like this. Unforgivable. This is a foul deed. Beyond foul. Let's go. The foe is somewhere in this forest. We must stop this before any more die. Ah. Uh, beware. Something comes. What? Kya! Lindis! If you value her life, send the girl to me. Ah, uh, you, you're a Sakan. That's correct. I'm Yuhai of the Black Fang. I've been sent to capture the girl, and to kill the lots of you. If, however, you hand over the girl and depart the island at once, I'll grant you your lives. And if we refuse, you know nothing, little lord. Nothing of Nergal's might. Nothing of his terrible power. You are ignorant, and so you, you hope to oppose him. You are insects railing against the heavens. Your actions will change nothing. Speak no more foolishness and be gone. Maybe we don't know what it is we're fighting. But if we flee, our loss is assured. So we will continue to struggle, and we may yet prevail. Folly. What? Why are you letting me go? Holding a woman hostage during battle is shameful. You, too, are Osake, and I have a mind to show you mercy. I won't let you die with a sword in your hands, but rest assured, I will kill you all here. But be of good cheer, in dying you shall all be spared the calamity that is to come. Ninian, you must hide. We will meet the enemy. And here we go. We could ask for advice, though I'd rather not worry about it. What I do recommend you bring along is a thief and Florina. Other than that, there's really not much else to do. I have Canis with me. I uh, left Urk, Marcus, Sane, Bartray, Rebecca, Will, Kent, Raven. These are the troops I'm bringing along. These are all their items and such. Um, there's really not much else I can say other than let's just jump right into it. Defeat you high. Merlinus became level 10. Yeah, let's deploy him. And we have Dart. You're Isaac, right? I'm Dart, leader of Fargus Suicide Squad. The captain's ordered me to follow your commands. So, who do you want me to take care of? I'm back, my lord. Matthew, are you sure? You don't have to. What are you talking about? Look at this eerie place. This thick fog. This is exactly why you brought me with you. Yet, if Layla... If Layla knew I was shirking my duties, she would never have forgiven me. I'm fine. I will work twice as hard for Ostia and her honor. I understand. I'm counting on you. As well... As well you should, my lord. Tell me, Layla. This is what you'd want, right? You would've want me to give up. 
I'll mourn for you when our battle is won. I must fulfill my duty, so rest. I promise I'll take care of everything. <sighs> Alright, I'm back. Boom, we're good. Let's just get moving. Sorry about the cut. Had to do some... <sighs> stuff. Uh, it's going with the javelin, even though it's kind of weaker. Um, what else can I say? Kind of, this is like my fifth attempt doing this because I've had terrible luck so far with my first two attempts. My third attempt was good, but then, unfortunately, my recording system crashed. And so now I'm just kind of making do with what I got here. Let's go on, let's have, uh, oh, I should have given Kent, damn it. No! He has a sword, doesn't he? Fuck. Oh. Um, kind of messed up there. Should be okay, though. Let's go on, let's move Dorcas up. Um, but yeah, you kind of want to get a... I've tried this many times before, I already know how this whole fucking run works, but I keep just having terrible luck with it. Let's go on, let's move. Mom's one here, have an attack with Javelin. Um, yeah, I just had terrible luck, I went ahead and decided to change out, um, Canis and Lucius for Kent and Rebecca, because I feel like they do better. Now I just kind of have to make things work with them. Uh, let's go ahead, let me attack with this. Boom. Go. Matthew along here and have Priscilla company right here. I don't know. No rescue, just stay right there. Move Lynn along and we'll leave Priscilla there for the most part. Um, you're gonna want to be careful, I guess, because of all the different troops that can arrive. You have yourselves cavaliers to the south, you have yourselves uh, pirates to the north, you also have yourselves some mage users and other cavaliers to, um, and pirates to the east. So make sure you spread out your infantry pretty well. You keep on guard of what's gonna come up or who you're gonna face, and uh, hold out. There we go. Um, okay, got to level up in HP, luck, defense, speed, and strength, Ugh, or skill and strength. I mean, um, boom. There we go. It's gonna get health back, thankfully. Um, let's do this right. I actually have our javelin equipped. Should have the. Ah, I should have that equipped in the beginning. Good. Miss. Attack, please. Thank you. Should have hit you the first time, but it's fine, I guess. <sighs> Come on now. Stay right here. Have him attack. There you go. Take whatever experience you can low and it's fine. Move Dorcas up and have him swing the hand axe. Oh, come on. Why do I have such terrible luck? Just why? Just take care of him. Boom. How? Elliewood. How? Thank you. Holy crap. Jeez, uh, I can fucking miss everything, huh? Move Lynn up. Have her be at the ready. Attack with the bow. Move Hector ahead. Have him ready. Uh, Priscilla's fine right there. We'll move Oswin and Dart along. So, and that should do it. Attack Dart, of course. <laughs> Why do they get two attacks and I don't? That's not fair. Whatever. Come on, Hector. Should be okay. Go. Nice job taking care of him on your own. Thank you for that. Who's next? More Cavaliers, of course. You're gonna attack Elliewood. Taking more and more damage that I don't want to take on. You're gonna attack Dart, their longbow. Damn stupid long range. Okay, come on now. You're gonna attack Elliewood as well. Gosh, this is not good. It's getting too low and I don't like it. And it's a Hector. Come on now. Okay. Who's moving where? Ah. I found them. These men are Black Fang. Look, everyone. Their sacrifices were not in vain. I'll fulfill our duty. Even if I must do it myself. I am a true knight of Ilya. We have ourselves an NPC. And we see that they have arrived into the aid with where they are a Pegasus Knight. Let's go have Florina bring her close to Fiora and see what she has to say. Sister? Fiora! Florina? 
Florina, why are you here? I'm here with Lady Lindis. What are you doing here? I was investigating the Dread Isle for someone. By yourself? No. There were others. A full unit of Pegasus Knights. We were attacked. You can't mean... I misjudged our situation. All of my knights are dead because of me. I'm a failure. That's not true. You're splendid, Pegasus Knight. I chose this path because I admire you so. Please, don't do this to yourself. Florina, please don't cry. I'm sorry. No, it's my fault. The pain of being the sole survivor. It had me trapped. Thank you, Florina. I can see clearly now. Fiora, come travel with us. It's better to travel with friends than to struggle alone. You're right. I hate to admit it, but I can't do everything alone. Nor can I render my companion's sacrifices moot by going home. Florina, please introduce me to your commander. I'll see if I can offer my services for a short while. There we go, we have a new ally, which is Fiora. She is a master in lances, just like um, Florina. Though she has a steel lance and javelin, her um, levels are... She is level 7, she does have decent stats all around. Though she's a Pegasus Knight, I would treat her lightly and just be very careful with her. Because of, well, you wouldn't want to get her KO'd by accident. It's going to have a dart attack. There you go, take care of that troop. Okay, should be alright. There, uh, let's move Hector along. Hector can't get very far. Let's move Hector along. Attack that. We'll have Rebecca help and take care of the rest of it. And we'll have Hector move along and just wait right here in the forest. Uh, as for this portion, move Kent right here. Let's have him attack with the Steel Lance against you. Boom. Do it again. I was hoping you'd do it again. It's fine though. Let me move Elliewood back and have him heal up because he needs it. Go. Oh, move Dorcas along. Have him attack with the hand axe. There we go. Just take care of that unit. <sighs> move Lowen up. Um, and have him swing at. I'm going to attack this one. I'm going to attack the archer. The archer is a bit more of a worry. Boom. There we go. Taking this is the whole of our javelin equipped in case. Low one gets a level up. There we go. Level 8 with the boost in HP and luck. It's not bad. It's pretty good. Get us as a torch. And now I kind of want to just keep Priscilla and Matthew um, on guard because they can really take loads of damage if I'm not careful. Guy's fine there. We're gonna move Oswin up. Um, I'm gonna wait right here. That should be alright. See how they move. Can attack Guy as expected. Yep, pirates to the north. Guy should be able to handle them on his own for the most part. Though we do have Lindis in case. Let's see. Okay, you're gonna attack Kent. Interesting choice. An Iron Lance versus a Steel Lance. Pretty sure. We know how this is going to turn out. Go. So, and attack Lowen. He's got his javelin, so he should be okay. Nice. Go oh, do it again. No, that's fine. Nice job, Lowen. Thank you for that. And attack Hector. Interesting. I don't get how you guys. or how I miss, even though I'm in the forest. But whatever, it's fine, I guess. We have a Black Fang Shaman using Nose for Ratsu on Oslin. I don't think that's the best idea. I'm gonna heal up, of course, but it's not gonna do much. Well, we can just KO you 